Hey guys, welcome back to some tech news. Today I'm going to be giving you guys a little overview on what's new with Firefox. Uh, so today, if you guys haven't noticed, uh, this article is actually talking about a Windows 8 Metro or modern UI app for the, the Windows 8 OS platform. Now, uh, Firefox has been in the talk since like the beginning of Windows 8, and now they're starting to come out with beta versions of uh, Firefox for Metro, meaning that you can run Firefox within the Metro UI instead of on the desktop, as you can see here. Now, the current version that I'm using is actually the desktop version of the Metro for Firefox. I believe it's version 21 and uh, it's code word uh, nightly. And if you guys wanted to, you can actually test it out right now. I'm going to give you a link to this article if you want to read more, but I'm going to show you about you know the whole metro and let you know what it looks like uh, but there is a link right here you can just download that and just install it and just use the metro version of firefox so let's go ahead and take a look at the actual metro or the modern ui version of the firefox it's code word nightly so if you guys want to look through your all apps the chances are you're going to find it under n for nightly and not firefox so when you first open it this comes up and it'll open up and as you can see it's more of a full screen ui However, if you wanted to, it has plenty of options that you can go ahead and tweak around with. If you go over here, you can find a page. If you wanted to, you can zoom and minimize. You can add a favorite by starring and you can pin a web page to the start screen. If you go over here, there's not many options in regards to settings while you're in the app. If you go over to options, you'll see this right here. It gives you the option to go ahead and open the tabs from the last time. So if you had five tabs, it'll open with those five tabs. Also, it says it can always show tabs. So instead of having that whole full screen you can see these tabs right here will always be shown and you'll have only this backdrop shown right here uh, synced it depends on your account if you have a account that could be synced go ahead and do that and also it allows you to remember passwords it tells sites not to track you and it uses a master password for all your other passwords and also if you just wanted to clear all the private data that you have been browsing throughout your your history you can let's go ahead and take a look at how fast a site loads up if i were to go to google.com it loads up pretty fast if i were to go to a more flash based site let's say for example youtube it loads up pretty fast also you would need a plugin and i'm pretty sure it's available for the metro ui but i'm not quite sure so you might want to check that out another thing in regards to the tabs it actually saves a live thumbnail tile to where if you were to scroll down a bit it just saves it where you are let's say for example if i wanted to go ahead and star that i can and if i wanted to go ahead and pin it it also gives me the option to go ahead and name it so if i wanted to i could put flipping windows and just put it like that or i don't have to have any name at all and i could just delete them all and and just pin it to the start and if we go over here to our start menu you can see that it's just a blink icon which is pretty cool however nightly overall it looks pretty decent i have to admit um, and it loads pretty fast as well if you guys haven't noticed it if i'm going to go to this central base website it loads in like less than a couple seconds experience super speed if you guys just want to look further into it you can I have the download link in the show more tab if you guys want to go ahead and check out this metro version of firefox code word nightly so if you guys like firefox go ahead and download it you finally have a metro version if you guys like this video go ahead and thumbs up and share this video in regards to sharing it with people that might want to use firefox for their windows 8. yeah so until next time if you guys enjoy this video thumbs up and take care bye